We got them <laughs> crack babies out here, you feel me? But when you come and you visit Atlanta, you have to realize that these people that you are meeting are not from Atlanta. It don't sound like that's my type of vibe, you feel me? But <laughs> hey y'all. What's up? Welcome to woo, baby. Welcome to Vlogmas Day. Okay, wait a minute. Let me think. I guess this could be day three. Welcome to Vlogmas Day three. We three days in. We three days in. We three days in. We three. Okay. Anywho, I just got off of work and I'm going to a birthday dinner karaoke night type thing. So, so I need to find something to wear. I gotta do my face. I gotta fix my hair. Um. I think I want to wear heels. Ooh, I think I do. I think I do. I think I do. Let me show y'all the heels that I'm going to wear. And I got to be mindful of what shirt I'm going to wear because my underarms need to be waxed. And I would shave them, but I can't shave them because I'm going to get a wax on. If you know, you know. So. Oh, y'all about to die. Hold up one second. Let me take this hot ass jacket off. I got your backpack back. One second. Hold up. One minute. All right. Let me let me show y'all the shoes. One second. I thought I knew where they was at. Okay. Wait. I gotta find these shoes. Okay. Okay. I think I found them. No. <laughs> oh my God. Those are not it either. I found them. So I'm gonna wear these. The heel is really skinny, but I'm gonna wear these shoes tonight. I feel like they're appropriate for the event. Now I gotta put up all these shoe boxes that I um, took out. I was thinking about this coat, this coat, but it's a little bit too light. I could still wear it over top and just put a nude like hello hello come on stop playing with me boy okay and just put like a nude color long sleeve you get what I'm saying <laughs> okay so here we go so it's gonna be plain but I don't want to be, I don't want to be doing too much, you know, it's not my birthday. And the shoes still don't really go 100% all the way with the shirt, because the shirt is a, yeah, the shirt is definitely lighter. But, no, yeah, that's definitely lighter. I don't know, y'all, I'm going to have to find something, but I got to hurry up and get, get ready, because, um, I need to still fix my hair, and I want to go and vote today. For early voting if you're not in georgia um we're having a runoff election between raphael <laughs> between raphael warnock and um herschel walker i don't even know why we had to be like get get here like who but you know what everybody has a right to their own opinion their own political opinion and views so we're not gonna get into that i just really don't understand why that's even a thing you know after all the stuff that we're hearing come out so yeah i'm gonna go ahead and do my makeup and then i'll come back i won't spend too much time um showing y'all me doing my makeup because for one this is not a good video with me this is a i don't even know what it is but i'm gonna see y'all when i get dressed so y'all can see how the outfit came out and um yeah all right y'all so i am pretty much done with my makeup it it looks like it does not match my neck on camera but i promise y'all it really does and let me see y'all what time it is oh baby it's 4 47 and my lips look so bright on camera, but they're not that bright. Um, I want to be out the house no later than 
5 30 so i have to hurry up um i don't even really know if i like my lip combo i'm probably going to end up putting like some brown or something on it to calm it down a bit i don't know um, but my makeup came out pretty darn cute tonight. And if my lips, if my, uh, lip combo run out, then I'm just gonna put on gloss because it's kind of a lot to be doing. So, oh, look, let me tell y'all something. So, I, I got, oh my gosh, it's like this. I got this, um... Laura Mercier setting spray, right? And it don't work. So I gotta find me a spray bottle or something one of these days to um transfer that in because baby, ain't nobody finna waste no money. Is you cr is you crazy? And if y'all hear anything in the background, that's me watching Aaliyah. Aaliyah's face, you know. So I'm about to try i need to fix like like my curls is is fine but i need to fix like my natural hair because i haven't sorry uh, i haven't been doing anything to my natural hair part i've just been like rolling it up with the hair of course um but i don't be straightening it or anything yeah, and I haven't been doing anything to it because I'm natural and I don't want to mess up my natural hair, of course. And on top of everything, I still don't know what I'm wearing. I'm probably just going to have to make it do what it do. Like I said, it's not my birthday, so. But you know, I still want to make sure I'm looking like, you know, yeah. Alright y'all, so I actually changed my outfit. Let me show y'all. I'm wearing all black. Um, with some gold accessories. This freaking toilet in here is so loud. The toilet is so loud, so I'm going to just show y'all. Pants. This cute top that has this cutout right here. Okay. okay yeah but i need to get ready to go because um traffic be crazy for one my hair it's just freezing up already like i literally just like just fixed it like maybe 15 minutes ago that's that sounds like just to me so um excuse my room if y'all see something out of place because it's a lot of stuff that's out of place right now because i was getting ready and y'all know as females we gotta invite a tornado in the room before we can actually figure out what we're gonna do it's like belt belt thing that i have on it's not even a belt it's from one of my bags actually and i just use it like a belt like a strap from my uh, from one of my purses and i just literally wrap it around me and like do these little funky like um little thing right there and yeah so i'm about to go ahead and head out because it is right at 5 30 if i'm not mistaken let's see it's 5 23 and i need to take my charger with me because my phone is about to die and i don't know where i'm going so, so i'll see y'all when i'm pulling up or whatever i don't even have time to get a car i'm just gonna have to give it to her on another day i know that's so like so ghetto but um i'm just i'm re i'm rushing so i don't have no other choice i just want to show y'all the bull crap that we have to go through is 612 and there should not be this much traffic like I have it took me and the expressway was 59 minutes it 
wave. I'm pretty sure it was longer than that because I'm still not there. I still have another 23 minutes. Well, technically I'm downtown. Technically, this is downtown. Um, I just haven't got off the expressways. So to get to Peach Street, Peach Tree Street, um, it's gonna take me another 23 minutes. Well, Peach Tree, Peach Tree Road, <laughs> y'all. I can never, I've, like I told y'all, I've lived in Atlanta all my life. And I just don't think nobody can say that. Peach Tree. I just don't think nobody can say that. It's just a part of us. Like, if you can say peach peach tree, you're not from here. Peach tree. That's what I say. Peach tree. Peach tree street. Peach tree road. Peach tree. It's not peach tree. Like, that's just too proper. Like, what are you? BFFR. Yeah. <laughs> I was just kidding. But yeah. Um. It's been like this the whole ride. I had a little couple of moments where I was able to hit that thing. But it says I'm going to get there at 6.37. The dinner is at 7 o'clock, which is good. So I would be on time. I was staying in the second lane from right. Okay, we got to get over. I was really, really worried that um I was going to be late. Child. I got to try to get over. I knew it. I hate trying to get over in traffic. And people are like they don't want to let you over. I'm just gonna nope. Oh, let's go up here. Let's squeeze in front of this truck right here. Oh, he not. We ain't got time because he just got over. So we're gonna get over right here. You see me trying to get over? You you seriously not gonna let me over? You fucking fuck. Oh. People literally get on my nerves. Like, literally. Like, why would you do that? Okay. Yeah, he was coming right here. That's Grady. That's good old Grady. That's been taking care of me since I was a baby, baby. Mama been working at Grady all my life, baby. Well, not all my life, but majority of my life, baby. Mama been working at Grady, baby. And Grady, let me tell you something. I think I said this. Well, I'm going to say this. Y'all haven't seen that video yet. But if I don't, cut it out. But, baby, if you ever get shot, tell them to the take your ass to right. If you down her and you in some stuff you ain't got no business being in, or sometimes you can really just be walking and get popped. But if you get popped, if they put that bullet in you, tell them to take you to Grady. Do not let them take you to Emory. Tell them to take you to Grady. Don't let them take you to the Cal America. None of that. At you need to go to Grady. Use the right two lanes. Period. To turn on to Everybody know that. Everybody know that. Grady, trauma and Grady. Maybe they go hand in hand. If you look trauma up in the dictionary, it say Grady. This man. Oh my God. I wish I could. I wish I caught that. This man is holding up a damn. <laughs> okay, we are Stay in Atlanta, so now we got them. <laughs> we got them. <laughs> Crack babies out here, you feel me? Um, this man was just holding up a freaking, you know how they hold up a sign? This man was holding up a a, a rim, a car rim. Like, sir, where did you get? Where did you get that from? Who rim do you have in your hand right now? BFF and what do you want us to do with that? Are we supposed to buy that off of you? My lips look crazy. I'm gonna put another gloss on top, another um color on top, but yeah, like BFFR. The only reason I've ever considered living in the city or close to the city was for the lights at nighttime. That's literally the only reason because everything else ain't worth shit the crime is terrible the um prices is terrible like everything in the city is terrible the people are terrible um one one the people are ter and i really hate when people come to georgia and be like oh people in atlanta are so rude da, 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 da. 
No, when you come and you visit Atlanta, you have to realize that these people that you're meeting are not from Atlanta. Like, we, are, we ain't living out here. You feel me? Like, we ain't out here. We is on the outskirts. So, that shit. Oh, shit. Hold on. Y'all need to be getting over. I need to be paying attention. But, yeah, this shit really be pissing me off because it's like, we ain't out there. You feel me? Like, we ain't, we ain't out there. That shit too high for us. That shit too high for us. For real. But, yeah, we, we ain't out here. Because you, you got to think, they're doing a lot of regentrification and stuff and um, building all these high rises. Seriously, don't do that. You know what I'm saying? Bullshit. Oh, well, we're on Georgia State campus right now. I would turn the camera on, but I really can't do that right now. Um, oh, okay. The, and these, the roads is fucking terrible. Like, whoo, baby, you know me. You know when you about to hit a pothole, you just gotta, you just, you just gotta, you just gotta ride with it. Hold your breath and blow that bitch out. Um, yeah, we're not out here. That's that's just what I'm saying right there. This is one of the Georgia State um dorms right there. But yeah, we're we're we are on Georgia State campus. I mean, I'm pretty sure you could tell with the Georgia State symbol in the in the flow. And the students just walking by. Oops. I'm going to see y'all when I get there because for one, I have no idea where I'm going. And for two, a lot of these streets out here, that's another thing that's fucking terrible. The streets is terrible. Like, you can't go down this street, but you can go down this street. You can't come up this street, but you can come up this street. Because it's only one way straight. So I'll see y'all when I get there. Okay, bye. Alright, y'all. I made it. I'm the first person here. <laughs> Thought I was going to be late. And my best friend is still an hour away. But, um, <laughs> I'm waiting on the birthday girl to get here, and I'm just waiting outside. It's real cute out here. I'll show y'all in a little bit. Um, but yeah, I almost had to boop somebody's ass. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, it's so an update. I still haven't ate. It's 7.56. So, I went to one place. It was the wrong place. I waited for the car for 30 minutes. It probably wasn't 30 minutes. probably like 15 minutes. I got in the car to go to the, the right place. Then come to find out, the people said we couldn't go there anymore because they could only hold the table for 15 minutes. So, then we ended up at the second place that we was going to, which was a little karaoke place. But by the time we got to the karaoke place, the people called her back from the first place that I was supposed to have been at and told her that... Uh, if we don't show up, it was gonna be $25 a person. So now we headed back to the right place that I was supposed to went to in the first place. I hope you follow me. Because I ain't saying this shit again. Moral of the story, I guess I'm about to eat. Okay. Bye. I'll, I'll show y'all the, the, the food when we get there because it smelled so good at the other place. So hopefully this place is like the other place, the wrong place that I was at to go to the first place because the first place better be good. Like the last place. I don't even know if the last place was good because I was supposed to be at the first place in the first Okay. Bye. Took our names, which means we can eat because the first I was to try to stay at the point of getting. Um, but yeah, we made it. I'll show y'all the menu and stuff. We're still waiting on her. All night, we've been waiting on her. <laughs> All night. All right. I love it. This is salmon. Curd curd salmon. It don't got no It don't got no smell to it. It don't taste like nothing to me. Yeah, I'm fine. That's actually good. 
Mm -hmm. You know, I'd be scared of stuff like that. I got salad, uh, Caesar salad. No, what is what's it? Artichoke, anchovies, anchovies, and egg yolk. Take that shit off. And this is what the cured salmon look like. And they come with these chips. I think these chips is really good. For me, um, an amaretto sour. I'm a dark woman, honey. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe I should, I should try it. I'm trying to expand my palette to big girls. What does it, what is it going to taste like though? It's not going to be really a different? I could have, we need to get safe. We just need some different menus so yeah okay so a happy birthday to Tiani may you live to see many more and enjoy the rest of your day even though they had you fucked up <laughs> it is okay okay cheers all right y'all so I finished my food clearly it was it was pretty straight but I only had I had chicken like my kind would and I ate my potatoes they taste like box potatoes I ain't gonna tell you no lie the amaretto sour was very strong the spinach tastes very greeny the um The Caesar salad tastes like fish, but they said it had, it was like the dressing was probably made with like artichokes, so that's, oh, oh, anchovies, I keep getting that wrong, um, what else, that's all I had, yeah, that's all I had, but the cured salmon was actually good, I wanted to get it by myself, but it was good, and that was it, how was your food, Claire? It was good. It was good. Um, what you have? I had the halibut. It was good. Um, if you're not a fan of pistachio, I'm going to give it up. There's a lot of pistachio. Um, you had pistachio? I ate a lot. Of it. He's allergic. For real? Yeah. I ate a lot. Of it. Yeah. Yeah. The Brussels sprouts were amazing. Yeah. Um, I don't believe what you said about the spinach. I enjoyed the spinach. It was really good. Um, the roast potato was good as well. Yeah, the roast potato was really good. Yeah, the roast potato was really good. Yeah, the roast potato was really um, I had the holy water to drink. It was pretty good. It was strong, so it's a good drink if you're just trying to come and get drunk. Uh, but if you want something like it's kind of calm, it's kind of extra flavor. Uh, but but uh, if you want to get drunk, it was really good. Really and that was all. Nicola, what you had? I had three buns, medium red. It was red, bitch. 
media prayer. Ooh, they just keep <laughs> Yeah. With the Brussels sprouts, uh, I, I ain't going, I ain't going. So what you had? You didn't have a drink, right? You had water. No, I didn't have water. She had water. Hell, I had water too, because I ain't drinking my drink. Yes, thank you. You're welcome. So the little manager came over here, right? And introduced herself or whatever, like she reading from a teleprompter. It was so rehearsed, it was not genuine at all. Just to say thank you for coming, type shit. Um, but you could have just simply said thank you for coming, we're glad you're here, type shit. But she, I didn't like it. So I got to telling her because she asked us how was everything so far, and I ended up telling her about the miscommunication that we had to not come and then that we had to come after we had already selected somewhere else to go. And she was just like, Oh, thanks for telling me, I'll bring it up at the next meeting. Okay. And I, I'm not saying y'all don't because people think that black folks always looking for something for free, baby. That's the last thing I'm worried about is a free meal. But it was just like, where is your customer service with something like that? You get me? Like, we've been riding around all of Georgia for like damn three hours. <laughs> and, and if not to mention, like, the traffic puts an extra two hours on top of whatever truck. You get what I'm saying? So it was just a lot of back and forth, and that was such an inconvenience for your customer. But overall, the atmosphere in here is dope. They got like a little patio, like outdoor patio type thing, but it's covered. Um, and it sounds like they got some vibes going out there. If that's your type of vibe, it don't sound like that's my type of vibe, you feel me? <laughs> but, uh, I mean, if you're just trying to come and get mellow and, and be somewhere like with your boo or something, I would definitely recommend it. Um, apparently they have a dress code in here. It's not strictly enforced, so, but yeah. y'all so that was everything for tonight um i hope y'all enjoyed this vlog i did enjoy myself even though my lips look real crazy right now but um it's in a night i'm not finna fix nothing um no um even though we had the mix up with the restaurant i went to the wrong location and then the location that i was supposed to be at ended up telling us not to come or that they couldn't hold the table and then we ended up going somewhere else and then they ended up calling her and saying that we had to come or they was going to charge the car charge her car so we ended up going back and then we ended up going. it was a lot but at the end of the day we all enjoyed each other she enjoyed her birthday um i got to see my best friend because baby he be so busy well we both be busy but he be more busy than me so we don't really get together like we used to so it was really good seeing my best friend it was also really good seeing my old co-workers as well um i wish we had a little bit more time at mike well it was like mike karaoke i think it was m i c d karaoke um that would have been really really nice if we would have been able to be there longer but because we were running late there we only had like 45 minutes in here and then also they don't sell mixed drinks they only sell bottles and you can't bring any outside beverages so even if you wanted to bring a chaser or whatever you can't um so yeah but other than that the food was okay i would not go back there honestly um claire would you go back to that restaurant uh -huh yeah so we would not go back there <laughs> and, and we are food people like we we likes to try new foods or new places and that's just something that i would not go back to um i mean you can check it out for yourself it's called five church there's one in buckhead and one in midtown so check it out for yourself but i'm just telling you as a foodie, I wouldn't do it. I don't give a damn <laughs> how upscale it want to be. I won't go. Um, what else? Tiani, thank you so much for inviting me to your birthday. Happy birthday again. You looked very great. Like, 
I just pray that when I get up there, I ain't saying up there like you just old, but you bitch you is getting up there. But <laughs> when I get, you know, get your age, I just pray that I look just as damn good as you did. Because bitch, you look good. So happy birthday. Um, Again, thank you for having me out. We're going to have to get together again real soon. Plan the next um, outing or inning, whatever y'all want to do. And I'm down. Um, but yeah, so good night, y'all. Happy Vlogmas Day 3. I'm about to take this makeup off, get in the shower, and edit this video for it to go up tomorrow for y'all. Um, and yeah, bye. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe too. I didn't say that, but I thought y'all had already knew that. I mean, duh. Like, if you're watching, just go ahead and like and subscribe. Only makes sense, right? Okay. Bye. See y'all tomorrow at my brother's birthday party.